Hello there steve -os. welcome to this week's episode of Steve's Weekly Vlog here on my YouTube channel, Steve Official. It is Monday morning, it's my week off work, and I'm starting off this week away from work by heading off to Damon's house to go and see Damon, and I do believe that Kim is also going to be there as well, so I'm also going to be meeting up with Kim today. So, without further ado, let's go and see Damon and Kim on this Monday morning. So, I am at Damon's house on this Monday with Kim and Damon. Hello. They're right there. How are we both? Very well, very well. Good. Good. Damon, did you enjoy your birthday? Yeah, it was a nice chilled one. I wasn't feeling too great um, earlier in the week, so I kind of just chilled out at home with my mum and played some games and stuff and just had a nice chilled birthday, really. Yeah? And Kim, how's your holiday from work going so far? Just working at home. Oh, just working at home. That, that's it. Just working at home. Yeah. So there we go. Anyway, uh, as mentioned, it was Damon's birthday yesterday. And me and Kim have got him some birthday presents. So we're going to start with me first. I've got a bag right here. A swag. A swag. It's like plastic. I know. It's, I've decided not to go for the gift bag look this time because every time I go for gift bags, it fails. It breaks, isn't it? <laughs> it always breaks. Oh wow, that's fucking sick. What is that? It's like oh, it's a lava lamp. Well, it's, yeah, it's sort of like a lava lamp, but obviously Actually, the icons. I love that. Yeah. That's so amazing. Icons flow lamp. Yeah. That's amazing. Thanks, Steve. That's alright. I love that. That's actually sick. Pretty little brilliant, aren't you? Yeah. Oh wow, more like. And there's another one as well. On, off. My room's going to be awesome. It's going to be like <laughs> an alley. You got those lights. How amazing yeah. is that? That's awesome. There is, uh, there is one more thing as well. Thanks, bro. Which is a, a little present which I can fit in my bag. So I'm literally just trying to get it out now. Uh, there we go. Hey, Boba Fett. A Boba Fett it's one. It's a light as well. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> <it's> <laughs> light. <laughs> yeah. I it's went for a light it's theme. Birthday boy. Any men at your age rush out and buy themselves a new set of wheels. <laughs> it's, it's a new baby. <laughs> Two day when happy birthday. Hope you enjoy your day. Get lots of prezzies from Kimbo. Look. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good card, Kim. I love that. I love that card. <laughs> and then presents. It's supposed to be another thing, but it never came, so I'm not sure what's going on with that. It's I can't right. track them down because hopefully it won't set some. <laughs> that's the one I got you, that's the one I got myself as well, so I got, I had to get one for myself. So we both got one. Oh, I think I know what this is. I was saying about earlier. <laughs> yeah. Oh. I'm telling you anyway. So, what is this notebook? It's a notebook. It's a Lost Boys notebook. Yeah. That's actually I've, amazing. I've got, one, I've got one as well. That's actually amazing. It's <laughs> well cool. I know. I saw Lost Boys had to get it, I had to. Metallica. Metallica. Another Metallica, Metallica shirt. shirt. It's a really cool design. So. Oh, that's mm. sick. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Shirt to the collection, love it. <laughs> I love my shirts. You do, don't you? I love shirts, yeah. I always wear shirts. Well, who doesn't wear shirts? But... <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember what the third thing is. Oh, I do now, I remember now. Is that a scar? I'm liking. Hey. I love that. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? That's awesome. Fun K-pop. Yeah, I love Scar. It's always my favourite Disney villain. And that's right. I saw him against Get You With. Be prepared, isn't it? Yeah. That's my favourite Disney villain song. Hey, thanks, Kim. That's all right. Thanks, Steve. That's all right. <laughs> oh, I love it. So, it is Monday night, and this is what we have for our dinner this evening. We have got some fajita wraps. Chicken fajita wraps. They do look good. Enjoying it, Kim? I'm trying to wrap it up. <laughs> trying to wrap it up. Mine's already wrapped. I, I believe, anyway. Is it already wrapped? Yeah, it is. Because <laughs> it was falling out, trying to put it back in. Oh, is it? Oh. Uh, it's all like, coming out. <laughs> I'm trying to put it as I can. <laughs> so, yeah, so that is uh, what we've got for our dinner this evening. 
and also as well we've been watching uh, some movies today at Damon's house been watching The Crow um, we started watching a little bit of My Bloody Valentine but then we turned it off because it was terrible it was, really <laughs> <laughs> it was absolutely awful oh and we also watched um, Eden, Lake. Eden Lake as well yeah which that wasn't a bad film but you know it was it's a bit it wasn't brilliant though it was void? yeah and the void which was very flashy but we we didn't we didn't realize how flashy it really was but um but yeah so and now we're currently watch we me and Damon have decided to show Kim Bo is afraid um because we think it's funny Kim do you think it's funny so far <laughs> a little bit a little bit. It gets funnier. It, yeah, it does get funnier. Actually, I think it's where we're at right now. Yeah. I think it starts to get funnier. So yeah. So that's what we're just about to. So we're just about to have some uh, dinner right now. Good morning, everyone. It is Tuesday morning. It's just gone seven o'clock, and I have just woke up and got dressed. And behind me is the tumble dryer because yesterday, before I started filming the weekly vlog. I put some clothes in the washing machine from my basket and stuck it out on the washing line to dry and because it was a nice day yesterday and I forgot to bring it in last night anyway I've just opened my curtains in my bedroom to find that there's massive puddles in the road and you know what that means it means it's been raining and yes my clothes were still on the washing line and they were soaking wet. So I put them in the tumble dryer to dry off. Great. So this is what I've got for breakfast today. I've got chocolatey square cereal with, yep, a lot of milk. And I've also just made myself my first flask of double choc mocha of the day as well. It is Tuesday afternoon. It's just gone 1.30 at the time of recording this part of the weekly vlog. And I've just taken my morning medication because I've been super busy this morning. Uh, I've cleaned the bathroom, so that's nice and clean now. Um, I went shopping um, at Asda in Castle Point and got some bits and pieces because today... Me and my support worker, uh, he came over to my house and we were downstairs in the kitchen and he showed me how to do a Japanese omelette. And uh, it was it was it was okay. It 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 went well. It could have gone a little bit better for me. Um, you know, because I mean I clearly don't know how to toss eggs. Um we've learnt that today, that I can't toss eggs. So, I'm going to keep practicing, I think, um, on my tossing egg skills. Um, but other than that, though, I will say this. The Japanese omelette was absolutely delicious. As, as a matter of fact, I do have a photo of it, which I will show you guys right now. So, here it is. Um, and doesn't that look really, really nice? It looks like something that you would get in a restaurant. Or maybe in a posh cafe or, or something like that. Uh, but it was really delicious though. I really enjoyed it. And I even did one for my mum as well. And she enjoyed it as well. So all in all, it was a nice meal. Very filling as well. Very filling lunch. So I think that means we're going to have something light for dinner. Which I'll show you uh, very shortly in this vlog. Um, and then yeah, after that I washed up. And then we, uh, me and my support worker went out onto the backfield and we had a walk along the backfield and I took Simba uh, with us as well. So we had a good conversation for about 20 minutes, half an hour about stuff. So yeah, um, so I will be seeing my support worker again in two weeks time. So he said to me that we are going to do some more cooking sessions together in the future just so that he knows how well my cooking skills are coming along and stuff so yeah um and now for the rest of the afternoon because i've been busy this morning i've decided that i'm going to chill out and i'm going to spend the afternoon watching some movies i think on my on my tablet so let's find out what movies i'm going to watch this afternoon in this part of the weekly vlog watching a movie called your next right now on my galaxy tab s7 plus device now watching the movie Hush. Now watching Are You There God? It's me, Margaret. Now watching 47 meters down. 
Now watching Last Shift on Prime Video. For dinner this evening, I have done myself some tuna on toast. Tuesday night and I have just got out of the bathroom after having a shower and I'm in my pyjamas as well. Uh, I've also got my washing out of the tumble dryer as well so that's now in a washing basket on my bed which I will probably sort out tomorrow. Anyway, uh, what is the time by the way? I did just look at my phone just now. It's 20 past 11. 20 past 11. I was supposed to be in bed an hour ago, but here we are. We're still here. I'm still awake. Um, but yeah. Um, anyway, I'm going to head off to bed now because I've got a very early start tomorrow. I will reveal all in a few moments time in this week's weekly vlog as to what's going on, what's happening. Because I've not mentioned anything yet about what's happening tomorrow. Um, so I'll mention that in a few moments. But all I can say for now is I'm really, really excited. Really, really excited. Uh, so all that's left for me to do is take my nighttime medication, my last flask of tea for this evening, put my vlogging camera on charge, ready for the day ahead tomorrow, because I'm de definitely, definitely going to need my vlogging camera tomorrow. That's for sure. Um, and I'm just going to close my curtains and say good night, world, and I will see you tomorrow. Good morning, everyone. It is Wednesday morning. We're halfway through the week and halfway through this week's weekly vlog. Now, I am currently out. It's just coming up to half past seven in the morning, and I'm going to be catching the bus and going off to uh, Bournemouth train station with Damon and Kim and we're going to be going off somewhere now Damon as far as I'm aware <laughs> as far as I'm aware still has no idea as to where we're going I don't think um, me and Kim know where we're going but Damon doesn't but I'm going to tell you guys now anyway um, so basically obviously Sunday was uh, Damon's birthday as you all know uh, as I mentioned last week and so me and Kim have decided we planned it out last week and we're doing it now this week um, hence why we met up last week we've decided that we're going to go away from Bournemouth away from Paul away from Christchurch away from Dorset in general and instead we are going to go to Brighton that's right we're going to Brighton, yeah. Now, <laughs> I'm so excited, I really am excited this morning. Now, Brighton is somewhere I've never been before, it's somewhere Kim's never been before, and it's somewhere that Damon has never been before, neither. So, I think it's gonna be a fantastic day, a lovely day, and I can't wait to do it. I can't wait to film it, neither, for the vlog and stuff, and spend some quality time with Damon and Kim there, because I think it's just gonna be another fantastic day. Anyway, so I'm now going to head off and catch the bus uh, to Bournemouth train station, meet Damon and Kim there. And without further ado guys, let's take you all on a journey to Brighton. Let's go. So we are at Brighton and we are at this place here called Palm Court. And uh, these are our cocktails. Look how amazing they are. They're very, very strong mind. So there we go. And I have got a halloumi burger with some chips. Damon's here. Hello. How are you finding it so far? It's lovely, honestly. It's such a nice place. Like, Were you shocked that we yeah, got no. to Brighton? I was so happy. I've always wanted to come here, so it's just like a really surreal experience. Yeah. So lovely, honestly. Thank you both. That's all right. That's okay. And what have you got for your lunch today? I've got a chicken burger with some chips. And you also got the same cocktail and as well. Same cocktail. And Kim's also got the same cocktail. We all went for the same cocktail. Copy me. Yeah, <laughs> copy Kim. And she's also gone for the same as me, a halloumi burger with some fries. So yeah, so we're about to tuck in and have some lunch. And this is what we've got for dessert here. So me and Kim went for the same. We've gone for an apple crumble, Lotus Biscoff apple crumble with some toffee sauce and some cream on top as well. So, and Damon's gone for something different. I went for a brownie. Gone for a brownie. There it is, with some whipping cream as well on top. So yeah, uh, really nice in here. Um, really good service, really good wait uh, waiters and waitresses as well. 
It's Definitely, nice. yeah. Is it nice? Uh -huh. I'm going to give mine a go now, but um, yeah, really nice place in here. I definitely do recommend it.
uh, at a rock alternative bar and uh, we have got some cocktails, me and Kim have. Uh, this is a Cantoritos, so it does look really nice. It's nice and cold as well, so there we go. And Damon, what did you go for? I went for a vodka and coke. You went for a vodka and coke. Just a single. Just a single vodka shot yeah. with coke. Yeah, that's fair enough. So, have you enjoyed today though? It's been really good, honestly. Yeah. Such a lovely time and um, again, Thank you. That's okay. <laughs> he did say actually he was going to keep thanking us for God knows how many more times. So no, it, mean, it means a lot. So yeah, uh, it's just really nice that we all spent today together. Really. Yeah. Yeah. It's been definitely. A lot of fun. Yeah, it has. Kim, have you enjoyed yourself today? It's very interesting. <laughs> yeah. 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 How's the cocktail? I don't know. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. But what um. Yeah, the skull in it's pretty cool. Look at that skull. It looks so awesome. So, yeah, so uh, so we're rounding off today at Brighton by having some cocktails, chilling out uh, at this uh, bar called Brighton Rocks in Brighton. So, it is Wednesday night. I'm looking very red in the face. I know. I feel like as if, you know... A pretty woman has just gone on past me and I've all of a sudden just gone really red in the face and been blushing loads. Sadly, it, this is the effects of being in the sun all day and, uh, and you know, the, it being very, very hot as well. But I'm back home now from Brighton after spending the day in Brighton with Damon and Kim. Can I just say this, and I'm sorry, I'm going to be expletive here when I do say what I've got to say, okay? But we fucking did it. <laughs> we, <laughs> we fucking did it. All three of us, we went somewhere, the three of us, that we had never been before. We went there and we explored Brighton. And we had a lot of fun, like, I mean a lot of fun exploring Bar uh, Brighton, honestly. The Brighton Pier was beautiful, uh, the fairground ride that was on Brighton Pier, I think that was really good as well. Uh, we, didn't go on the, we didn't go on any of the fairground rides, mind, but we did appreciate them, and I think they were pretty cool as well. Um... Yeah, I mean, the Sea Life Centre, I mean, you guys saw the Sea Life Centre just now, and oh my god, that was, that was amazing, that was. Um, yeah, all in all, that was a fantastic day, and I can't see any, I, I can't see there to be any reason as to how that day could have been any more perfect because honestly it really was there was a lot of humor from the three of us you know just bouncing off each other with our usual banter that we normally have um you know honestly i i, I mean uh, yeah I, I also as well right I, I don't know my way around brighton but all of a sudden i was basically i was almost like the tour guide when we uh, when we went to Brighton Rocks because obviously Damon and Kim had no idea where they were going. To be honest, I didn't know where I was going neither. I was trying to wing it from Google Maps. But I do feel like there was a little bit of teamwork, you know, at some points as well. Like Kim was trying to find venues to go to. Damon kind of helped a little bit with trying to get to the venues. It was a fantastic day. Would I like to do more days out with Damon and Kim? Heck yes. Heck yes, I would. You know, honestly, I mean, our days out are just... They are great. They are fantastic. Um, we have got a couple of days out planned uh, across the next uh, couple of months. Um, so there is going to be more days out coming up. And you guys will be seeing more of that kind of content as well. Um, yeah, all in all, fantastic day. I do want to thank, I mean, I know Damon has thanked me a lot today for, you know, being able to take him to Brighton alongside uh, Kim as well. But I do also want to say a massive thank you to Damon and Kim for today because that was our first, that was our first time getting on a train together, the three of us. Um, and 
honestly, it was great. It was fantastic. I loved it. I loved every minute of it. I know the journey was long, but it was still a fantastic time. So I really, really did enjoy it. So massive thank you uh, to Damon and Kim for today. Um, and I really am looking forward to our next trip out, wherever that may be. Um, and whenever that may be as well. Um, but yeah, so... So yeah, so there we go. Uh, I've seen Damon and Kim twice this week. Um, so I would safely say that my week off work so far this week has actually gone pretty well. I've done quite a lot and I'm, I'm really impressed with what I've what I've achieved so far with my week off. Um, so yeah, so there we go. Um, right now though, I'm just about to nip back downstairs and make myself my last flask of tea for this evening. Um, and then I'm going to catch up on some soaps, uh, which I'll, re I'll reveal what I'm watching in a minute actually before I head off to bed. So uh, all in all though, I love today. I, I Honestly, I would go back to Brighton. I definitely would go back because there is more stuff for us to do. Um, I do think it does require us to have a second trip out there. Um, so, yeah, who knows? Uh, there'll probably be some more vlogging footage from Brighton again in the near future on my weekly vlogs. Um, so stick around because that's going to be coming soon, hopefully. Catching up with tonight's episode of EastEnders on BBC iPlayer. Now watching tonight's episode of Coronation Street on ITVX. Today on Disney Plus, a brand new Marvel Studios project has been released called Secret Invasion. So I'm going to watch the first episode of Secret Invasion now on Disney Plus. New episodes will be coming weekly uh, every Wednesday on Disney Plus between now and the end of Good July. Good morning, everyone. It is Thursday morning, and I'm currently back outside once again uh, because today I'm heading off to Pool to go and see my friend Kieran. So I'm just about to go up the road here and go and catch the bus to go and see Kieran. I've had a chat with. Damon this morning he's absolutely dead after yesterday um, to be honest with you I'm a little bit dead myself after yesterday but I enjoyed yesterday yesterday was so fun so anyway on to my journey now to go and see my friend Kieran in Paul let's go see Kieran so I am at Paul Weatherspoons and I have got a chocolate fudge cake with some ice cream I'm joined by Kieran hello everyone and what have you gone for? I've got the cookie dough sandwich ice cream. Cookie dough sandwich Which ice cream. Which is normally what I get, but I think last time I came here I actually got what you got. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I did. That one, yeah. And we're at a different venue this this time. Yeah, we are. Cause we're not one, the key. Yeah, the, the key's uh, kitchen was having it's, maintenance work done. Yeah, there, so. and it won't be open till the 28th of June. So we were like, okay, we'll go to the Lord Winborn instead, which is where we are today. But how are you anyway, yeah, Kieran? I'm doing well, thank you. Uh, our drinks hopefully will be here soon. Did you order your drink? I did order a drink, yeah. yeah. Okay. We've got empty glasses, so yeah. we're, we're waiting for another drink. Yeah. I need my Pepsi. <laughs> I need my Pepsi too. It's empty. Um, but yeah, so you're all yeah, good? No, everything's good, yeah. yeah. Yeah? Having a good week so far? Yeah, I am. Yeah, yeah, it's been so hot. It's, yeah, it has been really hot, oh, hasn't it? Drinks. Yeah. Oh, so yeah, so you. there we go. Um, thank you. So yeah, so uh, that's what we've got for our pudding and our Pepsi's just arrived here as well. F yeah. Finally, yeah. at long last. Yeah. So yeah, <laughs> so uh, yeah. And also as well, you tried going to the gym. Well, sort of, yeah. didn't you? Yeah, I went. Let's just <laughs> short, short. Long story long short. Long story short, it just wasn't for me. Or that, like, I tried to go swimming and yeah, I just wasn't keen. It just wasn't your it, thing. It just, be well, it just became too, too many Crowded. people in there. And you couldn't swim. And yeah, I was yeah. Like, and then I cancelled my Disney Plus subscription to, to, to go, to go there to, to the try gym. and save money. And yeah. Then I came out of that and I was like, right, I'm never going back there. I'm getting my Disney Plus back. <laughs> <laughs> just pulling that out just there. Just it out there. He, he chose Disney yeah. over the gym. Yeah. Well, initially, I chose the gym over yeah. Disney. Yeah. Then and then you went to back to Disney, Disney again. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to stick to my runs and my walk yeah. and my other exercises that I do. <laughs> that sounds I'll, like a good I'll, idea. I'll just go to the beach. Just go to the beach. Just swimming now. Yeah, just go into the sea. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> 
But you've got to try these things. You know? Well, yeah, that's true. You have got to try them. If you don't like it, then, you know, you don't yeah. have to do it again. So, so. Steve, he needs to go to the gym. Yeah, well, yeah, the one I mean, where Steve goes to the gym, I want that vlog, Steve. <laughs> Your viewers want it too. Oh god, so I really... Uh, comment below if you want to see comment it. Comment below if you want to see Steve. Would you actually do it if people comment saying... I don't even know. Would you actually do it just for a session? <laughs> you don't have to join as a member, you could probably just like... Just go the ones... Just go just, to a like, session or Just pay for one session yeah, in the you gym. you got to film it. you got to film oh, like, god. you going there. So we I'll just be on the treadmill and that's it. Because that's, <laughs> that's the only thing... That's the only thing... 45 I'm, minutes. For 45 minutes till my legs go jelly. Yeah. You wouldn't be able to move again after And then, yeah, I won't be able to move so but um, yeah so I've been spending the afternoon in pool with Kieran and we're at Weatherspoons just about to have some dessert oh man honestly it is so hot out there I've literally just had to put my fan on full blast on my face anyway I've just got home after seeing Kieran in pool for the day um, today we met up at 12 o'clock uh, we went to Greg's and we both got a sausage roll each and uh, ate that through Paul High Street, went to Paul Key, had a nice long walk along Paul Key, and then we went into the Key Weatherspoons pub. And as you've uh, just heard in that part of the vlog, there, their kitchen's out of action due to maintenance work being done and won't be open until the 28th of June. So instead, me and Kieran walked down to the Lord Wimborne uh, in Paul High Street and we decided to have. Uh, something to eat and something to drink in there and we had to chat as well um, and um, yeah well, it, it was really good to be honest really good um, to be honest with you right they do that they had this because um, I didn't show you guys actually what me and Kieran had for our lunch today um, because literally our dessert came and I was like you know what I haven't vlogged anything with Kieran yet so I should vlog something um, so I did obviously as you just saw um, but for my lunch today, I had this steak and kidney pie, which, by the way, actually tasted really nice. Um, they give you, like, a gravy boat, so you can kind of, with gravy in it, so you can, you know, pour your gravy over it. And even the gravy was nice. Um, I had that with some chips and some garden peas as well, so that was really nice. And I believe that Kieran had, I think it was ham... Uh, egg and chips I believe I think so it did look like that um, but yeah so um, oh no it might have been an all day brunch actually yeah it was an all day brunch because he said he went for an all day brunch um, I don't know why it just looked like ham egg and chips I don't know why um, and then obviously we both had our usual side of uh, five chicken wings as well I, I do love Weatherspoon's chicken wings because they are quite nice um, but yeah, so that's what we had for lunch today. Um, all in all, though, it was really good. I, you know what? I wouldn't mind going back to the Lord Wimborne more often with Kieran, to be honest. I mean, it was quite spacious, a little bit like the Quay. Um, I think you, I think they've got a li just a little bit more range in terms of food options. Um, yeah, so... But anyway, I do want to say, though, a massive thank you uh, to Kieran... Uh, for meeting up uh, with me today um, in Paul. Uh, it's really funny actually because I caught the bus back home and literally as soon as the bus started moving, I basically fell asleep um, until we got to around about Bournemouth Town Centre. So I was asleep for, I'm going to say a good half an hour on the bus. And it's really funny because there was a man sat next to me on the bus wearing a mask and not not like a not like a horror movie mask you know one of those masks that you saw during the pandemic that people were wearing um you know that would have been a bit weird if he'd worn a, a horror mask i i definitely wouldn't have slept on the bus then oh no no uh no he sat next to me he was wearing a mask anyway i ended up dropping off to sleep as soon as the bus kind of reversed out of paul bus station um and so, yeah, so I fell asleep knowing he was sat there next to me. Um, and then I woke up as we were approaching Bournemouth Town Centre. And I looked next to me. There was a guy sat next to me, a much younger lad sat next to me. And for a second, I kind of got a bit confused because I was like, eh, hey, what? You know, like, there, there, it, there was an old dude sat next to me before. What, what happened? 
<laughs> I thought I must have gone back in time. Okay, I must have gone back in time. Oh dear. Anyway, uh, that was fun. Uh, but no, in all seriousness though, I mean, I was knackered to be fair. I mean, I think yesterday, as much as I enjoyed yesterday, I think it killed me off a little bit. So, um, I have actually seen, um, Kim, Kim has, po I'm going to post some photos on social media very shortly, um, of my day from Brighton yesterday. Um, but I did see that Kim had posted some of her photos on social media as well today. And, um... Honestly, I, just looking back at some of her photos, it, it literally sent me back to yesterday when all three of us were together and we were just having such a lovely time. Um, and yeah, honestly, I, re I really do want to do Brighton again. I feel like there's, there is a lot more to explore. And honestly, I'm, if we do go back there later this, later this year, I will vlog more there because there is so much more to explore. And there's a few more venues as well that all three of us want to go to as well. So, um, but yeah, no. Uh, but going back to today, though, a massive thank you to Kieran, though, for meeting up with me today. Uh, I really, really do appreciate it. I can't wait to have a video call with him on uh, Sunday this weekend um, on Skype. And, uh, yeah, I really can't wait to meet up with him again, hopefully at some point in July as well. For dinner tonight, I've got beef casserole with some mixed veg and some potatoes with gravy. Good morning, everyone. It is Friday morning. I'm outside in the glorious sunshine this morning. And I'm on the backfield, as you can tell. And I'm walking. I don't know if you can see, but I'm walking Simba. I hope you can see that. Um, so, yeah, I'm walking Simba at the moment. I don't know what he's doing. He's pulling me back, so I don't know what he's doing. Come on. Let's go this way. Come on. Um, so apparently we've, I've kind of had a chat last, well, I mean, I had a chat with my support worker about this earlier this week, but then my sister kind of had a chat with me about this last night. Um, but because my mum, um, she can't really walk Simba too far, um, because of health reasons. So it's now become my responsibility, uh, just to walk Simba. So... My sister said for me to walk him twice a day, one in the morning and one in the evening. So I'm going to do that. So I walked him last night. I took him for a nice long walk last night, uh, all the way around the backfield and around this village as well, which is near the backfield. Um, and I'm, gonna, I'm not going to do the same today. I'm going to walk him around the backfield and then take him back. But um, yeah, my sister was like, can you please walk him twice a day? Um, so I was like okay cool so um so yeah so you'll probably see me coming back on this backfield a bit more often in the weekly vlogs as i'm taking simba for a walk so i've made myself a flask of tea and i'm just about to take my morning medication with my flask of tea as well my god this week's weekly podcast which is available to listen to now on spotify music apple podcast and google podcast is a very lengthy one uh, clocking in at nearly two hours uh, but coming up on this week's weekly podcast though episode 136 i'm going to be talking about taylor swift's concert because obviously the tour dates for her uh, eras uh, tour has been announced i'm going to talk about the international uh, dates of where she's touring and when she's touring uh, in this week's podcast. Also coming up, I'll talk about my trip to Brighton. Uh, I'll talk about Nintendo Direct as well. And I'm also talking about the Netflix to Doom event that we had last weekend as well. So all that and a lot, lot more as well coming up on this week's episode of Steve's Weekly Podcast, which you can listen to on Spotify Music. Apple Podcast and Google Podcast. Just search for Steve's Weekly Podcast to listen. Okay, so it is Friday afternoon and I am pretty much for the rest of the day just going to chill out after a very busy couple of days out and about and stuff. Um, so obviously podcast recorded. It's going to be scheduled to be released later this afternoon. All I've got to do is just do some work on social media just to promote it, which I'll do um 
a little bit later on. Um, but for the rest of the afternoon though, I'm going to chill out, watch some movies, and I'm getting a bit peckish now, so I've decided that I'm going to have some snacks which are in my room. So I'm going to show you what I've got for snacks. So I'm going to have these onion ring crisps and also I'm going to have a couple, of, I'm not having all six, don't worry. I'm going to have a, probably one or two of these nutty uh, nugget caramel bars as well. And I've also got a Coca-Cola to drink as well. And also as well, I'm going to watch this movie right here as well called The Loved Ones, which I have seen before. I've seen this film with Damon and Kim. But I've decided that it's been a while since I last watched it and I'm going to give it another rewatch again. So I'm going to watch that right now on uh, my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. Another movie that I have seen before, but I'm going to go back and watch it again. It's called Creep. Uh, I watched this one uh, with Damon and Kim in the past. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to watch that one again right now uh, on my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. Now about to watch Sanctuary on my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. Okay. So, I accidentally pressed on my gallery on my Tab S7 Plus device. I don't take photos on my tablet. I don't. I never do. But there's this one specific night in particular where I took all these random videos and photos. Now, you can't see them. Can't see the videos. Can't see the photos. Because when did this start? I want to look. So it started on the 21st of May. Started at 1 minute past 2 in the morning. That night. Or that morning. Okay. I'm going to show you this. I'm going to show you this. Okay. Look at this. Right. Just black tiles. That's because on my tablet, somehow or other, my camera must have opened up on my tablet and it's taken all these photos of nothing because I'm asleep at this point okay literally and then it gets very interesting because after that black tile there look as you can see there's all these little tiny video folders that is like uh like that one isn't even begun rec recording it's just not dot not not uh um, yeah you've got all these various one second two seconds i think there's even a couple of uh, there's a five second one there um there's a one second one there two second one there um yeah i mean i think there's quite a few of these i don't even know why these just started randomly filming or recording or whatnot i have no idea okay but anyway there is so many of them it's unbelievable and how i have got memory or storage still on my tablet i will never know but anyway this was all taken on the 21st of may okay today is friday the 23rd of june anyway this one here in particular look at this right once it decides to there we go that's better uh, i don't know if that's gonna work um, look at this. I don't know if you can see it clearly. I'm going to try and make it clear. Look! That tile at the very top there. One hour and eight minutes. Guess what? I'm going to click on it. Right? Because it's nothing. But listen. What the hell? Ah, it's creepy. This is me breathing when I'm asleep. <laughs> oh God, it's just nothing. It's just nothing. You just hear me breathing in the background. You can hear my fan going off. It's so weird. <laughs> Oh, jeez. 
Oh, man. This goes on, by the way, for a good hour and 28 minutes. Uh, an hour and eight minutes, sorry. Literally, I've just, like, fast-forwarded it to, like, half an hour. I wonder if I... I wonder if at some point during this... I start sleep-talking or something. <laughs> oh, God. I must have been really up close to my... To my tablet when this happened. I don't know. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Alright, oh god. Now I'm heavy breathing at this point. <laughs> oh, Jesus. So if you ever wanted to know what I sound like when I sleep, that's right there. <laughs> it's how I sound when I sleep. How did it take a video of me for an hour and five minutes? Well, nearly an hour and ten minutes. <laughs> oh, my camera must have been doing some wild stuff that night. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, dear. Oh, that's funny. Oh, that's comedy. To be fair, I'd rather a bit... I don't know. I'd rather a bit have taken photos of nothing than actually taking photos of me legitimately asleep and basically had the camera on my face with the flashlight on and filming me asleep for an hour and ten minutes that's random who did it it must have done it by itself i don't know <laughs> oh no Oh man, that's just killed me off. I'm sorry, that's just killed me off. Now I'm gonna watch the movie Surrounded on my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. For dinner tonight, I've got two burgers with cheese in between both of them. I've also got some baked beans and some sausages and some chips as well. Good morning everyone. It is Saturday morning and I'm gonna be having a pretty much a chill day at home today i've got a shopping delivery um that i'm waiting for which is coming later this evening um but i've decided that i'm going to spend most of the day probably in the lounge chilling watching some movies on my tablet i've just made myself a flask of double chop mocha um so i'm going to take my morning medication with that very shortly um to be honest i've not had many double chop mochas this week in a flask because uh if I've not been uh, if I've not been uh, drinking uh, tea, I've been drinking uh, Coca Cola. So yeah, um, so yeah. So anyway, so I'm going to be sat here for most of the day, probably watching some movies on my tablet. I've got this fan right here, if you can see it. Um, so yeah, that's that's blowing right at me. So and I've also got Simba with me as well. So I'll show you Simba. Look, there he is. That's sitting there very nice. No, 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 we don't come close to the camera. <laughs> you right, Simba? Uh, you're right. Uh. Anyway, um, so yeah, so that is probably what I'm going to be doing for most of the day. Uh, it's just chilling out. Um, and uh, I'll reveal what movies I'm watching um, in this next part of the vlog. Watching The Beach House on my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. What's up, guys? Now watching okay, Superhost on my Galaxy one. Tab S7 Plus device. So I'm watching the movie Possum on my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. I've also just made myself a flask of tea. And this is my lunch today. I've got uh, chunky chicken pieces in a sandwich. I've also got some cherry tomatoes and three gherkins. And I've also got a packet of Watsits. Look at the size of these Watsits, by the way. These bags used to be a lot bigger when I was uh, when I was a child. Look at them now! Honestly, they're tiny. What's happening to Watsits? Anyway, that is my lunch for today. And no, Simba, you're not having any of my lunch. Okay? Yeah, I'm watching you. I'm watching you. 
Now watching so Dave made the maze a on Amazon huh. Prime Video. Now watching the movie The Den. Now watching Guy Ritchie's The Covenant on Amazon Prime Video. So this afternoon and pretty much most of today I've been at home on my own because my mum has gone to my sister's house to help her uh, sort some bits out at my sister's flat. Um, so I've just been here at home today with Simba. Obviously, as you've seen, mostly been chilling in the living room. Uh, we've just had an Asda order arrive. So my mum obviously did a delivery, an online shop, and that's just come. And I've just sorted that out and put it all away in its respective places, like on the side or in the freezer if it's frozen or uh, needs to be freezed or in the fridge. Um, and before Asda did arrive and for me to go and sort that stuff out, I've been in the kitchen making myself some dinner. Um, I'm probably not going to lie to you, but I'm probably going to be doing enough for me to have something for dinner tonight and because my mum is going out tomorrow um, I think tomorrow lunchtime there's probably going to be enough for me to put in a Tupperware pot and put it in the fridge for me to have for my lunch tomorrow so let me show you what I have done so far so here I have done some chopped bacon and I've also done, this is already cooked chicken, but obviously it's not going to be in the frying pan for too long, to be honest. And it's probably going to be on a, uh, a low heat anyway, but I've chopped up some chicken chunks as well. So I've used the rest of this up that was in the fridge. And over here, I've used up some peppers as well. So I've got some yellow pepper and some red pepper as well. So I've chopped that up. And I've also added some spinach as well, which I've chopped very finely uh, with that knife right there and I have just got my frying pan out so all I'm going to do now is add some olive oil to the frying pan and then start adding some of the contents like the chicken and the bacon to the frying pan I'm also going to add some mushrooms to it as well okay so I've got a saucepan of boiling water there and inside there I've also added my pasta as well so that's boiling away in this sauce, uh, in this frying pan here, I have got uh, obviously the contents of my chicken, my bacon, my mushrooms. I've also added in now the spinach, the um, red pepper, yellow pepper as well. So that is all frying off there as well. Um, so yeah, so all I've got left to do really is just allow that to fry a little bit. I've added my seasonings as well, so like a bit of lemon juice, a bit of a, a red um, wine vinegar, I believe it was. I've added some salt, I've added some pepper, I've added some uh, onion uh, granules, I believe, uh, garlic granules, sorry. I've also added some thyme as well, and I've also added a little bit of nutmeg into that as well. So uh, hopefully that's going to sweeten things up a little bit as well. I may have added a little hint of sugar as well, just to kind of make it, uh, uh, kind of have a bit of a sweet flavour to it as well. So that is what I'm doing at the moment. In an une unexpected twist, I've just added some mixed veg from the freezer and look how colourful now this frying pan is, literally. It's like almost every colour that you would find in a rainbow, almost. Um, but yeah, so I've added some mixed veg now, so yeah, this is going to be a very colourful dish. So I have just got this tomato and garlic pasta sauce out of the cupboard, which I'm going to open the jar and then I'm going to pour all of this into the saucepan right there and I'm probably going to turn the heat down on this now as well because I'm going to safely say that the bacon and the mushrooms have all cooked all the way through now and there we are there we go so that is my dinner tonight I've just used bits and pieces that is in the fridge so this is just some sort of concoction that I've just come up with just bits that I've used in the fridge so chopped chicken um, breast chunks which were already cooked with a bit of bacon some red pepper some yellow pepper uh, spinach and mixed veg and I've also added some pasta and pasta sauce to that so just to make this concoction I don't even know what you'd call this to be honest but hey ho there we go that, that is my dinner though for tonight this Tupperware here is enough for me to have for my lunch tomorrow so I'm just going to close that now, um, if I've done it the right way, um, it's, not, it's on the right way. Um, so there we go, there we are, it's all sealed in. 
nicely. So now all I need to do is pop that in the fridge in a few moments. And meanwhile, now it's time for me to wash that up, wash that up, wash that knife up, wash this up, wash this up, wash this up, wash this up, wash that up from lunch as well, and wash that stuff up in there as well in the uh, washing up bowl, and uh, then dry it up and put it away. Watching the movie Reality on my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. Watching a movie called Jagged Minds on my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. So it is Saturday night and tomorrow, by the way, I'm going to go shopping because I need to get some more cereal. I also need to get some more milk as well because we didn't get any milk in our uh, Asda shop today. Um, but I'm going to go shopping tomorrow morning though at Castle Point uh, to go and grab myself some snacks for my room. But I did go over to the shop just before it closed. And I did pick myself up a couple of bits and pieces uh, for my room. So I picked up some Jaffa Cakes. So I picked those up. I've also picked myself up a uh, Mint Dairy Milk Chocolate Bar. There we go. And I have also picked myself up some Belgian buns, which I might have a little bit later on this evening. I don't know yet. Um, so there we go. And I also... Uh, tripping over Simba's toys. Uh, I also picked up as well uh, some uh, Pepsi Max uh, original flavour and mango flavour Pepsi Max as well because it's an offer at the shop which is two for £2.50. Uh, so they're in the fridge at the moment. I might have one now um, because I'm really hot. I know I'm wearing a jumper which probably doesn't help um, but I have literally just got back as well from taking Simba for his last walk of the evening around the backfield as well. Good morning everyone, it is Sunday morning, the final part of this week's epic weekly vlog. Uh, I'm outside on the backfield taking Simba for his first walk of the day in this glorious sunshine. Really nice and warm day today. Uh, so I'm going to take Simba for his walk and then straight after that I'm going to be heading off to Castle Point uh, to go and get some uh, bits and pieces for my room, snacks for my room. Um, and I also need to pick up some milk as well because me and my mum are running low on milk now. So I need to pick myself up some cereal because I'm running low on cereal. Anyway, uh, I'll show you guys what I got uh, today from uh, Asda at Castle Point in the next scene of this week's weekly vlog. So I've just got back from shopping at Castle Point at Asda and I did pick up a few things. I picked up um, some milk for myself and for my mum. I also had to pick up some cereal for her as well and, pick, pick, and picked up some cereal for myself as well. Uh, there's two things that I did get in the fridge as well which was like a Rustler's uh, sausage uh, bap which I'm going to have for lunch. I'll show you guys that very shortly. And I also picked myself up some 12 mini savoury um, eggs as well. So like miniature scotch eggs basically. Again, I'll show you those very shortly. Um, I did get those because they were both, both of those were reduced in the reduced cabinet. So I decided to pick those up for my lunch for today. So you'll see those very shortly. Um, and the other bits that I did get, I couldn't really get too much snack wise, but then again, yesterday I did get some bits and pieces. So to be honest, my snack box is pretty full now, but I did get myself some nutty bars. I also got myself some lemon and fruit pancakes as well, which I'll probably have either tomorrow or Tuesday. Uh, I also picked up some swell bars as well sadly they're not like the normal 12 bars that i usually get because i usually pick up the the 10 pack ones which are nice i do like the 10 pack ones but um yeah i picked up those ones today because those were the only ones that they did and i fancy fancy some 12 so i think when i go back to work next week i'm probably gonna pick up a 10 pack of 12s because i prefer those i do like those um and also as well, I picked up a lemon cake as well, of course, because, you know. And finally, but not least, I also picked up a lemon loaf as well. So there we go. So that's everything that I bought uh, this week at Asda in Castle Point. I'm probably going to get a couple more snacks when I go back to work next week. Maybe towards the end of the week, I'm not too sure. Probably towards the end of the week. 
so I've just made myself a flask of double chop mocha. I'm just about to have a shave. And while I do that, I'm currently watching the first Jeepers Creepers movie on my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. Tommy, huh? You see that? Yeah, I saw it. Anybody can read about it? Why you give old Dante back there so much ink, huh? I'm serious. People are starting to think it's yours. We don't. Now watching Jeepers Creepers 3 on my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. Watching the movie Till on my Galaxy Tab S7 Plus device. For dinner tonight, I have done me and my mum some uh, baked beans and sausages with a chicken and veg pie and some chips in the oven. And for dessert this evening, my mum has recommended for me to try this cappuccino Swiss roll, uh, which she said was really delicious. Now that I've tried it myself, I can confirm that this was really, really nice. And that is it for this week's weekly vlog. I've just made myself a flask of tea, which I'm going to be drinking while I edit. The rest of the footage that you guys have just seen uh, in the weekly vlog as well. Uh, for the rest of this evening, I'm just going to be having a phone call with my granddad in about half an hour's time. And in about an hour's time, I'm going to have a video call with my friend Kieran because it is uh, Sunday night. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. So thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this week's weekly vlog. It's been an epic week. Uh, it's been an epic week off for me. I've really enjoyed this week off. I've kept it a little bit chilled, a little bit laid back. And I've also done quite a little bit halfway through the week as well. And honestly, I really am so glad and grateful that I went somewhere that I've never been before with two other friends who have never been to the same destination before as well. Honestly, uh, in a couple of weeks' time, uh, so the next couple of episodes of Steve's Weekly Vlog, uh, Steve's Weekly Vlog, uh, or somewhere after that, uh, there will be another uh, day out that I am going to be doing with Damon and Kim, which I'm really looking forward to doing with the, uh, with them both. Um, so you'll find out what that is in the next couple of weeks or so, okay? So stay tuned if you want to find out where we go. Uh, but anyway, like I said, feel free to give this video a like, leave a comment in the comment section down below if you'd love to, and as always, if you are new around here, and if you like what you see, feel free to, uh, to hit that subscribe button uh, to become a Stevo. Uh, I will be back next week with your next weekly vlog episode. Not going to lie, it's going to be a little bit shorter next week uh, due to me going to the cinema, going back to work. Um, and I've also got some other bits and pieces that I'm doing away from the weekly vlog. So it's going to be a slight shorter episode next week, but I'll still try and uh, provide some great content for you guys uh, to watch in next week's episode. But from me, though, it's goodbye. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys again in my next weekly vlog.